So I posted this question on my Instagram. Now let's see how we can solve it. We have tangent theta is equal to 2 over 5, and the angle theta is in between of 0 and 90 degrees. The goal is to find out the value for tangent of 2 theta. And I know we can just use the double angle identity for this. But in here, we will actually try to do this from scratch, right? We will use the triangle method. And you can also make this into a proof for the general case. So I think that's beneficial. So let's have a look. Because the angle theta is acute, so if you look at tangent theta, which is given to be 2 over 5, well, the 2 is just the opposite side on the right triangle, and the 5 is the adjacent side of the right triangle. And let's take a look at the right triangle right here. Let's say here is 2, here is 5, and for the hypotenuse, in fact, doesn't matter. Here is the angle theta. Now, we want to get 2 theta. How can we do it all? One way is to just duplicate the angle again, right? Just go out theta more so the whole thing will be 2 theta. But the problem for that is, when you double the angle, you don't double the opposite side. You can imagine this. If this is 45 degrees, when you double it, you get 90 degrees, which is going to string up. You will now just double the side right here, right? So be careful with that. Therefore, instead of going out, in fact, we are going to go in of the triangle. Well, what do we mean though? Firstly, you can see that because we have 2 over 5, so this angle will be less than 45 degrees. Otherwise, it would be like 1, 1, right? So I'm going to use this bigger angle. I'm going to duplicate that. I will say this is the angle theta as well. And then I'm going to just connect like this. The good thing for this is that you see these two angles are the same now, so that means these two sides will be equal. We have, a, we have an isosceles triangle. Now, this angle, I'll tell you, it's precisely 2 theta. Why? Because of the exterior angle. Right? This angle is a sum of this and that. And just a super quick proof. If you look at this triangle here, this angle will just be 180 degrees minus this and that, which is 2 theta. Altogether, you have to add up to be 180 degrees on the straight line. So we must have the 2 theta here to cancel out the minus 2 theta in order to have everything 180 degrees. OK, okay now what though? Well, we're trying to find out tangent of 2 theta. So ideally, we have to do 2 over this, but we don't know what this is yet, right? Well, in math, if you don't know something, let's just call it to be x. But since this side and that side are x, I'm actually going to call this right here x. And for this, because the whole thing is 5, it will just be 5 minus x. So that x plus 5 minus x is just equal to 5. Now, since this is x, these two sides are equal, so this side will also be x. Pretty cool, huh? So as you can see, if you look at this right here, tangent of 2 theta, it will simply be 2 over 5 minus x. But now, what is x though? Hmm. Now let's look at this triangle one more time. This time though, we're just going to focus on the sides. It's a right triangle. Pythagorean theorem. This square plus that square is equal to that square. So right here, by Pythagorean theorem, Pythagorean theorem, we know that 2 squared plus 5 minus x squared equals the hypotenuse, which is x squared. And let's just solve this real quick. So 2 squared is 4 plus, expand this, you square the 5 first, minus 2 times this and that, so that's 10x, and then we add the square, so plus x square, and that's equal to x square. Now notice, both sides have x square, so they cancel, and the goal is to find out what x is. So if you look at this, that's 29 minus 10x is equal to 0, so 10x, now let's do it like this, 10x, bring that to the other side, it's equal to 29, so x is equal to 29 over 10, or 2.9, up to you, whichever way that you want. 
and then we're pretty much done just plug that in here so we have 2 over 5 minus 29 over 10 and uh, to simplify this perhaps let's multiply the top and bottom by 10 it's slightly easier that way on the top is 20 on the bottom that is going to be 50 and then minus this and that cancel so minus 29 and the answer for that is 21 so the answer is 20 over 21 yeah, just like that and in fact you can use this picture here just label this as a and b you will be able to get a general formula for tangent of 2 theta in fact let me show you so the fact is when you have tangent of 2 theta this is equal to 2 tangent theta over 1 minus and then here we have tangent square theta so you can go ahead and use this idea to prove this identity which i'm going to leave that to you guys okay that's it